Hey everyone, welcome, welcome. My name is Ebony Charisma. If you're new to my channel, thank you for tuning in. And if you've been with me, thank you for watching and staying with me, being so patient for me to come back and make this video for you. This video is so overdue. So overdue. This video is so, so, so overdue. And I know you guys that's been with me has been waiting and here I am to just give you what you need, okay? If you are a mom like me, if you're a caregiver, if you know someone who can benefit from these tips I'm about to give, please share it. Please do. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. If you want to give me some advice, feel free to do that too. I'm open to it. So let's just get right to the video. As you can see from the title, it's about that quick mom skincare regimen, right? Something we need in our lives as moms or as caregivers that we can still feel good and get the job done at the same time by just looking our best, feeling our best, and smelling our best, okay? So again, I'm gonna get right to it. First thing you want to do before you even turn on your shower or your bath, mostly shower, okay? Um, you want to use a hair removal. I use Nair. This is a sensitive one and I use it on, yeah, down there. <laughs> I use it down there, okay? Um, it, for me, I can get like a forest, but I don't like her to get that way. So I try to maintain it by using the Nair product. It is a cream. And again, this is sensitive and it says with coconut oil. So I do love using that product. I'm not really a razor person. I don't want to make a mistake in cutting myself. So that's why I use a hair removal cream to remove the hair from her. Now you can also use that same product for your legs and your arms um, and even your armpits if that's something you want to do. Um, but for me personally, I just use it down there and you just put it on before you even start your water let it sit for about five minutes depending on how thick your hair is me it's like five to, five to six minutes and then I'm able to step into the shower and the first thing I do with my rag is to wipe that area clean and remove the hair from down there and I use a separate rag um, to, to, to take care of my body so the second step after getting in the water and removing the nair I'm using the honey pot sensitive now this doesn't have any scent to it um it has like a scent like a product scent but not like scented where it's like floral or anything perfumey or you know uh natural oils no it doesn't have a scent like that it has a, a product scent but um what i do is with my hand i'll just pump it place it in my VJJ, yes, all around in my VJJ. And yes, I do use this first. And then once I rinse this off, I'll use this honey pot, mm, excuse me, to, to cleanse my lady area. I let that sit a little while, like five minutes. Then I'm going to use my washcloth and use this by Equate. This is their Everyday Moisture Body Wash. This is like the knockoff version of Aveeno. So I like Aveeno, it's a little bit pricey, but at Walmart, you can get this for less. And I really like it. It's very moisturizing. This is like my fourth bottle. I really, really like it any time of the year. It can be spring, summer, winter, especially the cold months. I really, really like this. So at this point, I've already cleansed my body with the Equate body wash. So now I'm ready to take the second washcloth and clean my little area down there, clean her good. And then after that, I, I use the Olay and shower body lotion. Now you do have to rinse this off because you know, the instructions say to do it. And once you come out the shower, you do not want to take your towel and wipe off. You want to take your towel and pack dry, or you can do like me, air dry. 
just be wet and careless and naked free and just throw your clothes on whatever right so yeah um you do have to again rinse this off i highly recommend this this is this is like takes the step out of you having to get out of the bath and putting on your lotion or your oils or whatever you can do all this in the shower i highly recommend it if you want to save time once you step out the shower again don't use your towel to wipe off pat dry then you want to use your deodorant this is by dove and I just spray one, two, one, two, done. And then I'm putting on some perfume. My husband bought this for me for our anniversary, which is on Valentine's Day. So it says Daisy Love by Marc Jacobs. It smells so, so good, y'all. I love it. Every time I spray it, I think of my hubby. Yeah, sorry, I smelled the, the lid. But my, my son plays with this part all the time. But I love it. And that's it, y'all. That's it. That's my quick skincare regimen. And no, you will not use the Nair every day unless your hair grows back to its normal length, like very long the next day. You don't use the Nair every day. So this is not an everyday use. But the other products I've mentioned can be everyday use. So um, the honey pot you put down there. You let it sit while you are in the shower. You shower your body, clean your body with this. Then you take this product, the Olay in shower body lotion. You take that, put it on your body, rinse it off, pack dry or air dry, use your deodorant. And this last part is optional, but I do it all the time. I spray on my favorite fragrance and that's it. That's it. I'm a busy mom. I want to look good and feel good, but I want to cut time down. So if you like this video, please like it. Please subscribe. Please share it. This may help someone. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask me. If you want to leave a comment for suggestions, you can do that. This is an open channel. Just be positive, okay? And love yourself. Odabo.